There's some other great town names. Latitz. It's Linitz. Linitz. <laughs> <laughs> The gentlemen here, uh, they came out here to do what? What did you guys come out here to do? What was, the, what, why? why we came you, out here to experience the weather. We, we just, just came, came out here to experience the weather. Experience, yeah, we heard about all the evacuation going on, but we just came out here to experience the weather. Is it better to go slow yeah. or better to go fast? Just a question. Um, I think you, you kind of vary it. Uh, you vary it. You yeah. know how you're, you're doing, you know, by feeling the burn, if you will. Something I, I noticed doing the shake weight, there's a little mirror on the top, Aww, so you can actually check yourself. Is that where the, uh, I've is, always wondered is that where the, like. uh, uh, is that where the cool down spray comes that? out? Uh, no, that's actually only hey. on South Park, but glad Allie. you just brought that up. Uh, and it went Allie. to sleep mode. Strange. Yes, go Allie, ahead, I got a question. Uh, it's Mark here, and they asked me to join in, but uh, I've got a small white one. Weird. Does that make a difference? <laughs> uh, no, actually, you know what? I don't think, I don't actually think it's the size of it. It's actually the technique and how you do it. Okay, thank you, Allie. Yeah, yeah, but thank you so much for asking that. I'm no, sure a yeah. lot of, of men at home were wondering that as well. Not Chris, because he... No. He told me he had the big black one. So, yeah, that's very good stuff. This has been parodied by here? Here? We'll probably sit around and cook some soups and eat bread and desserts and just get all fat and sassy. What do I do with that? Turn it, just sort of face it towards the sky, not towards the cameras. Upside down? Upside down. I've done it twice. You should have been watching. I wasn't watching. <laughs> I can't hear out of my right. Seeing double at Orangefield Elementary School. 19 sets of twins scattered from pre-K to fourth grade makes for a school record. <laughs> now can we go back? <gasps> You've probably heard the saying, it's like riding a bike, right? You never forget? Well, I hope that's true. Let it rip. Give us some gas. It's not going. Let out the plug. Guys, so what are you out here shopping for today? Pretzels. <laughs> Pretzels. You ready for the food court? Yeah. No, this is not an exotic oh my. necklace or a fashion statement. Oh. Oh. This is a real life snake. He is. Oh, my gosh. Take a camel ride, go to the petting zoo, mm -hmm. and just enjoy your night tonight, guys. And back to you, Tracy and Rachel. Good evening, everyone. I'm Pat Harvey. And I'm Paul Majors. Country trio Lady Antebellum was the big winner tonight with five Grammy Awards. Rapper Eminem, the big shocker, winning only two despite ten nominations. CBS 2's Serene Branson is live at the Staples Center with highlights and backstage coverage we're seeing for the very first time. Serene. Well, a very, very heavy, uh, heavy divertation tonight. We had a very Daris, Darison bite. Let's go to Terris Terris and let's put the bit. They had the pet. I was just saying it three rainstorms ago. Is that all you got? Well, you had a little bit more for me. You never travel faster than your guardian angel can fly. We're at a complete stop wondering if we go down for the freeway or up for the freeway. Kaboom! That it just hit like, you know. The but the park is still flooded, so you'll see kids out yeah. there again. Some of those kids today will be my co hosts It's just today. like, <laughs> dude, you got the best barrels ever, dude. Just like, you pull in, and you just get spit right out of them. And you just drop in and just smack the lip, pull back, drop down, snap, bah! and then after that, you just drop in, just ride the barrel and get pitted, so pitted like that. Corner is still trying to determine the cause of death and whether she was already dead when the truck hit her. We have new information now also on the plane crash. KTVU has just learned the names of the four pilots who were on board the flight. They are Captain Sum Ting Wong, We Tu Lo, Ho Li Fook, and Bang Ding Ao. The NTSB has confirmed these are the names of the pilots on board flight 214 when it crashed. We are working to determine exactly what roles each of them played during the landing on Saturday. Check your panties. About 175,000 rice. I think that was supposed to be pantries. <laughs> I couldn't warn you before I saw it, and I couldn't warn you, Eric. I'm just so About 175,000 rice and slow cookers are being recalled due to fire and electric shock. 
Andrews. Sure. Aaron Andrews. Yes. Aaron. Hello, and I rushed over here from MetLife doing the game with John, the Jets Bucks game, because you guys announced this morning that Bruno Mars would be Pepsi Super Bowl halftime performer, and he's not even here. What? What's going on? And the good news, I just found out that all throughout the football season, Fox is actually going to be unveiling who, what other artists are going to be joining Bruno Mars during the halftime show. So I'm excited to hear about that. Hopefully, I can. <laughs> This is like human frogger trying not to get hit by oh, oh, oh gosh! Are you okay? Are you okay? Alright, sorry. Sorry. I've actually been practicing my Ollie, you guys wanna see? I've been practicing hard, okay. Oh! Oh, oh, oh no! My <laughs> and definitely the place to be thinking about summer, especially if you're the outdoorsy type. I'm Stephanie Soviar, and coming up, we'll show you some things you can do to have fun in warm weather. Eyewitness News Health Beat is brought to you by Wizard Health Services. Action Southern supporter Christine Pay is up to see with what we know. Apparently, we don't have that story. We're right now, astronomers at the Shooting University. Shooting investigation in Southwest Albuquerque. You can see right here. Based on your last answer, how? I mean, you said yes. So I'm just saying. How? And you said no. Of course, you could be back in the party. I wanted to find out, I guess, really for me, this new moment. It looks like they're going to be bringing me on board as director of communications. But I wanted to find out if, in fact, what we have, I guess, really, maybe some part of that, you see, as that in communication. There we go. And today, if possible. Now, go. I was sitting at home and I was playing Fortnite and all of a sudden I just hear a bunch of noise and I look out the window and I start seeing the roof come off the houses in front of me. But then I sit back down because I only got like a couple people left in my gang. I was going to try to finish the game. And what's going through your mind is you're, you're, you said you're in the bathroom with your sister and nephew. I'm like, <laughs> I was, honestly, I was just thinking about the game. Was... It's Korea's latest workout invention that gives you shake way to run for its money. Take a look at what we found. Uh, according to the YouTube, dis what is going on? What is going what is on? That? According to the YouTube description, what? this is uh, for people who like to ride horses in front of their TV. <laughs> Am I reading? What is going on? <laughs> and, uh, like to keep... <laughs> Yep, in their own home. <laughs> okay, we're gonna, we're gonna move on from It's that. worse than the shake weight. You just read it, it's gonna get worse. With the shake weight. <laughs> look, at that, look at that man thrusting oh his bow. What is this? That's scaring me this morning. They're thrusting All their right. bow at me. Hopefully you're up Hold with on. us on this, <laughs> this Wednesday. Speechless. That was Sometimes really, just that was really alarming. Dreams in Motion organization has a fun time for the disabled. A deadly avalanche kills five in Colorado. You're watching the Evening Sunday on NBC North Dakota News, your news leader in high definition. Gay fucking shit. Good evening, I'm Van Tu. You may Good have day. seen our newest report, AJ, on NBC North Dakota News, and he'll be joining the weekend news team as my co-anchor. Tell us a little bit about yourself, AJ. Um, thanks, Van. I'm very excited. I graduated from West Virginia University, and I'm used to, um, you know, from being from the in East Coast. Okay, well, welcome aboard, AJ. Thanks. Go for it. A fatal ATV crash happened yesterday in Williams County. Officials say Kevin George rolled with his ATV while turning from Canal to 151st Street. George was thrown from his vehicle. He was not wearing a helmet and pronounced dead at Mercy Medical Hospital in Williston. 
Runners participated in the London Marathon today, less than a week after the bombings. Athletes paid tribute to the victims of the bombings with a 30-second moment of silence observed before the start of the men's elite race and the match.